Hello everyone, my name is Matthew and if you're watching this video the chances are you've been redirected from this one which was my old tutorial on um, how to put your favourite tunes into the game Euro Truck Simulator 2 or at least a Steam version. Well, um, that video got a few dislikes and the reason why I have realised is because it was partially incorrect and I'm going to correct that for you. So, in this readme file I actually managed to misread it, my bad. <laughs> um, what it actually says you should do is put all your music in a folder, a folder separate from your EDS2 music folder and create a shortcut to that folder within your music folder in EDS2 so let me explain how that works so I've got a tune here, this is um, Lean On by Major Laser quite big in the uh, charts recently if I'm going to make a new folder for this, I'm just going to call it um, ETS2 Music ok, I'm going to put this tune into that folder so now that's in there, all happy so far now if you go into documents and your track simulator to music, what I said to do before and in the old version of this video is to stick the old, like the original um, source file into this folder. That's not what we want to do. It's quite simple actually. You just want to go to new shortcut and we're going to go browse because searching doesn't really work in this. And you're just going to take that folder. Go next. Just call it ETS2 music and there you go. That's all done now. So anything any raw um, files in this folder, I believe um, mp3s work no, mp3s definitely work, but um, I haven't tried anything other than mp3 so just be wary, make sure your format is compatible with the game um, but yeah, any any mp3 files in this folder will be playable within the game I'm just going to demonstrate that now, so I'm going to go into Steam and launch the game So now in the game, just uh, as you launch up your profile, and then fingers crossed if you've done all those instructions right, which I, I don't see how you can get them wrong really, they're quite simple, you will have your tune here, which you can then play accordingly, there's your volume slider there, whatever you want you can do, excellent. So yeah, that was um, a an amendment to the previous tutorial on how to put your um, music files into your track community. I hope that um, fixed any queries that are coming out with the old tutorial. And I wish you a good day trucking with your favourite songs. Yay!